Yeah, it's over there now. That was you, wasn't it? Yeah. Now. I know that lady right there. Yeah, good seeing good you. Good to see you, too. I'll see you Monday, I know. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Good yeah. seeing you. Ta-ta. I think about
adults who's not affiliated can take a couple steps back. Like, they just want to get the shots. Other businesses and ambassadors and board members, chamber members, y'all can get the shot, get up there. Who else are we missing? Because I can't get everybody to you. I can't get everybody to Somebody called. 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 Kind of behind to the sides or on the sides if you're not big. How you doing? Hey, Diane. You need to be able to make this Get them to happen. squeeze in on this side just a little bit. This more. side, I need you guys to squeeze in a little bit like you love each other because we're not getting in. I really need everybody between the two brick pieces yeah. on the end. If, we, if that can be possible. I can even get the Chester sign and this other brick if they'll just kind of. Yeah. So I need Hey, I'm good. Yep, I'm good. Keep scooting this thing back. Everybody can hear, right? We're good? Okay.
you mean? This pictures? Yeah, 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 I got you. Sorry, I'm late. Welcome. I would like to just say um, we are so blessed to have beautiful weather today. And we are beyond excited um, to a big, big, big Reedsville welcome to Love the Travel Stops and also Chester's Chicken and our second McDonald's location here in Reedsville. So I'm Diane Sawyer, I'm the President and CEO of the Reedsville Chamber of Commerce. And um, to guys, I can't say enough about this is proof of what's happening in Reedsville. And uh, we're proud to be a part of it. And uh, Team Reedsville is getting bigger every day. So I just want to say welcome. We've got a lot to cover today, so I'm not going to talk too, too long. Um, but we're going to start with our national anthem by Miss Louisa Brown. Oh, say can you see by the dawn's early light what so proudly we hailed at the twilight's last gleam whose broad stripes and bright stars through the perilous fight o'er the ramparts we watched were so gallantly streaming and the rocket's red glare the bombs burned flag was still there. Oh, say does that star-spangled banner yet wave o'er the land of the free and the hope So, I would like to introduce our prestigious mayor, Dr. Jay Doniker, uh, mayor of Reedsville, and uh, he also has with him the city council. So, I'd like to turn it over to him for greetings from the city of Reedsville. I just want to thank all of you for being here, but more importantly, I want to let you know that this is something that the Reedsville City Council seriously considered about how we can pull this off over the last three years and it is without the support of our council that's standing right behind me that made this happen and we're able to work with all the different pieces of the puzzle that were necessary to successfully bring this to fruition. It all started with Bill Gleason from Love's coming by and looking at the site and saying, you know what, give, give me two choices and I'll pick one and this is the one he picked and I'm so glad he did. So I want to welcome all of you to this ceremony. I can tell you that this is probably the largest ribbon cutting I've ever attended, so you're not the only one. And I just want to thank you to pass a thank you on to the Chamber of Commerce, uh, Diane Sawyer in particular, for organizing this. And you know, this, this is an indication of what's happening in Reeves and what's going to continue to happen in the years to come. We're, we're not done. This is the first shot. So this is great. Thank you very much for coming out. And I would just like to say um, a little wave. Uh, the City Council has been a huge supporter of the Chamber, so I'm just going to go down the line really quick here. Start with Councilwoman Cherry Walker, Councilwoman Teresa Scoble, Mayor Jay Doniker, Mayor Pro Tem Harry Brown, Councilman Donald Gorm, and Councilman uh, Willie Harrison. So thank you all so much for your constant support of us in the City of Reedsville. I'm thankful to all of our law enforcement. I see we have our Chief of Police here and our Sheriff Sam Page. And, they're consistently um, there for what we need uh, 
to do what the business that we need and so we're appreciative for you all um, we've got a lot to do today so I'm just gonna cut to the chase and we're gonna go along and, and introduce our, our folks here so um, we're gonna start with Love's Travel Stops because that's where it all started so I'm gonna turn it over to uh, their district manager David Hansen and I believe they have a few things to say and also some presentations to do yes ma'am thank you um, just very quick, uh, on behalf of the Loves family and Loves Travel Stops and Country Stores, um, I can say that this is probably the warmest welcome we've had um, in the last couple opens we've done here. So uh, first and foremost, thank you uh, for today. Thank you for the opportunity. Um, it's been a tremendously warm welcome for us, even before we even opened the doors. A lot of businesses providing our general manager and our restaurant manager the opportunity uh, to use their facilities to uh, bring in the great employees that we have here. So uh, again, uh, I just want to say thank you, and I look forward to a fantastic relationship with the town of Reedsville. So, I believe we're going to start um, with the check presentations. Okay, all right, so we'll go up first. We have, um... <laughs> okay, so I'm going to bring those folks out front. So Heather Witsit, the executive director of the YMCA, if you could come out here, and we'll just put the we'll put you out front in front of the ribbon here. And then David, you and anybody else want to step right out front? All right. We'll let you do that, and we'll. So uh, one of the things that Love's really prides itself on is uh, reinvesting back into the local communities that we have the opportunity to uh, be a part of. And with every new store opening, the, uh, the Love's family uh, gives us as local managers $2,000 to donate to uh, those who have really helped us out and uh, really get the doors open. So I know our uh, general manager, Maria, uh, when she came up here, we were looking for a place we could do uh, interviews and uh, and whatnot. And uh, the YMCA opened their doors for her. And uh, because of that, we have a donation for the local YMCA for $1,000. So thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Copy that. I have pretty much everybody up front, just wide of the building, love sign in the background. And then, uh, Ron, our uh, restaurant manager here, he is a uh, local, uh, fantastic hire for us. And uh, with that, we asked him, you know, what other businesses or, uh, or um, charities in the area would benefit? And uh, Ron so graciously uh, volunteers his time at the local soup kitchen. And he uh, asked us if we could um, kind of split the pot as it were. And we thought it was a fantastic opportunity. So for the other thousand dollars, we're gonna be uh, donating that to the local Reedsville soup kitchen. So thank you. Thank you so much and loves. We are so grateful that you chose us. We are grateful that you are in the city of Reedsville and this most generous contribution will go a long way. Reedsville Soup Kitchen is open 364 days a year. Uh, they're closed for Thanksgiving and another community takes care of that. But this money is greatly grateful. Okay, so now I would like to turn it over um, to McDonald. So we have um, our owner, Tony Delgatti, down here. And I'm going to grab that mic down there. I'm going to have to grab that mic down there. All right, hey, hey everybody, thanks for coming out. We really appreciate it. We, we love to be here, no pun intended, with uh, Loves. We're great, they're great <laughs> partners. Uh, we, uh, we have a restaurant downtown, but for us to grow and, and add another restaurant, it's been tremendous. I want to say a special thanks to Victoria Moore, our general manager, uh, Norman Atkins, our supervisor, and Mike Tipo, our director of operations, uh, who helped make this a reality. There's a lot of work. It was over the holidays. It was it was the worst time to, to try to do something uh, right before Christmas, but they pulled it all together. And uh, Love's a bit, has been a great partner. Uh, everybody over there has been been great to work with. Um, we 
we're glad to be here, and uh, you know, we, we thank God for this great day, and we uh, we look forward to uh, doing a lot of selling a lot of burgers as a as a third generation owner operator. Um, you know, my grandfather, and my father, both in this business since the uh, late '50s, so uh, it's in ketchup's in my blood. I've been around it since I was a kid, and uh, we we uh, we're happy to be here, and we're we're uh, we're looking forward to doing great things together. That's fine. Dwayne, right here, if you'll step out. Um, I know that our athletic director, um, I know that Joe's not here, but since you're a Rockingham County School and you were going to speak anyways, if you could just accept it for this purposes, I think they want to present that for um, Reedsville High School um, and then also turn it over. So I'm going to turn it over to, um, and I will say this, uh, Tony's not going, to, not going to divulge this information, but his grandfather was the inventor of the Big Mac. So when he says third generation, he's not kidding. Like. Um, so, Barb is the, um, Barb, Barb here is my buddy. She is phenomenal. She is the woman that gets it done. And poor thing, she's been down and out. Like Tony said, it's kind of the worst time ever because she, she's had a little bit of a, a time herself over the holidays. And um, so we're just thankful to have her here and have her stand in and, and, and be here for everything to celebrate. So you guys have some presentations as well. So Barb Dudley. Hi, everybody. Um, I just want to point out that Thank you, Barbara. Uh, I want to say again, uh, thank you, Tony Delegati and Barbara. When I first met Barbara and Tony four years ago, I think, we've been partnership with Rockingham County School Transportation Department and transporting our students. And when I said, hey, we're trying to do some things for our drivers in Rockingham County, they were on board immediately. And they have been consistent year after year. And uh, I've gained some friends out of this as well. So. Um, yeah, my first job uh, was uh, 16 years old, was at McDonald's. And I uh, worked there two years, and boy, it was uh, a great opportunity, great experience. I learned a lot of things. And I tell people today, there's so many things that I learned working at McDonald's with uh, customer service, and it's just kind of gone with me a lifetime. You don't forget those things. But we're very appreciative. Our county, Rockingham County Schools, is very appreciative of what you guys do and continue to support us. Thank you so much. Our check presentation was for, uh, for missing Joe Walker. Um, we are going to present a check to Joe Walker. He's the athletic director at Breedsville High School. Um, we've been big boosters for the sports teams there, uh, so we will still give the check. We're going to give it to Dwayne to pass on, or um, you might be stuck in traffic. Uh, but I wanted to also mention that on January 23rd from 5 to 8, we're having a fundraising night to finally get those championship rings for our Reedsville Rams 21st state championship. There's only four 
uh, teams in the country. I thought it was, okay, yeah, they, oh, so that was the day that they lost last year. They won 20 years in a row. Okay, so anyway, um, we want them to finally get those championship rings, so come out and a good portion of our sales will go to uh, to the athletic department there specifically for the rings. Uh, also, tomorrow we're having, you know, more of a, well, a grand opening of our own with Paw Patrol, and you guys, some of you guys back there know our Paw Patrol um, and uh, Chase and Cake and Prize Wheel and giveaways. So come on out for that. Thank you. And I just want to say too, Dwayne would not say this, but as they're speaking about Precious Cargo and he's the Director of Transportation, they just were awarded the highest ever, I think, safety rating for their buses, and so that's a huge accomplishment and achievement for them, so. All right, I think we're there. Is everybody ready to cut this ribbon? Yeah! So, all right, so this is what we're gonna do. We're gonna take some of our normal shots, so, uh, Mr. Mayor, you know how that goes. So, Kayla, I'm gonna direct to you, and you just let us know. Everybody smile. All right. Everybody looking here? Ready when you are. All right. Now, to be fair to McDonald's, if I could have this whole group shift down and just for a picture, we're gonna take a we're gonna do a, a ribbon cutting for McDonald's. So. Everybody shift down and we're gonna I'm gonna grab another ribbon. Tim's got it, because he's the man. They're gonna keep the bows to the love, right? <laughs> yes, I'm going to oh, okay. okay, sorry. They didn't give me any other instruction than the one Okay. They filmed that part. That's what I was saying. Okay. Hey, right here would be good actually okay. because the cars will be covered. So just spread the, yep. Yeah. They are, give that to her. I'm gonna let McDonald's hold on to those. These are yours to put on your doors and wherever y'all would like to place those. Perfect. Perfect. All right, I'm gonna slide this and me right here beside of me car. And I'm sorry, Dave, come right in, come right in. All right, if everybody on this side will squeeze in this way. How much more we gotta go? All right, I'm good. Are you going to leave this right here? Okay, are you going to leave this right here? That's good. Yep. Okay, all right. So, we're ready? On three. One, two, three. Woo okay, so there are refreshments on both ends, so please come in and tour and see everybody and visit visit everybody to all refreshments inside. And Facebook viewers. 
So, hey, Facebook viewers, thank you so much for tuning in. As you can see, we had a wonderful <laughs> ribbon cutting here for our Love's Travel Stops and our McDonald's and our Chester's Chicken, which is owned here by the Love. So, thank you so much for tuning in. I hope you guys are going to come out and see them um, very soon. Uh, tomorrow is their grand opening for the community. As you heard, they're going to have Paw Patrol, they're going to have cake, and they're going to have refreshments. So, come celebrate tomorrow for the community grand opening and stay tuned. You know, you have more coming from the Reason Chamber and Team Reason.